you are about to hear a discussion of a first in the history of exploration. The most distant human-made object, NASA's Voyager 1 spacecraft, is an interstellar space. The space between Miyoku the stars. was brought to tears when Voyager 1, the first man-made object to exit our solar system, showed something so unbelievable. After traveling across the cosmos in silence for decades, Voyager 1 came upon signals and disruptions that scientists had never seen before. Signals that cast doubt on our understanding of extraterrestrial intelligence and space. What was visible to Voyager 1? Was it a message for us? Or was it just a chance find? Tonight, we explore the backstory of this poignant discovery and its implications for the future of humanity in the cosmos. The silent voyage into the unknown of Voyager 2. Launched in 1977, Voyager 2 was a daring venture into the unknown as well as a quest to investigate our solar system. The purpose of this mission was to investigate Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune, the outer planets. However, its adventure didn't stop there. Following the completion of its primary mission, Voyager 2 continued its journey outward, passing through the heliosphere, the sun's protective bubble. We are shielded from the harmful cosmic radiation by this bubble, which is created by the solar wind and magnetic fields. To pass through it is to enter the vast and enigmatic void between stars, which has never been visited by any man-made object. Voyager 2 made history when it crossed the helipause, the line where the influence of our sun ends. Decades after it was first launched, this occurred in 2018. It moved into interstellar space, a place that differs from the magnetic fields and cosmic rays we encounter inside the solar system. Scientists were able to gain a better understanding of the space environment beyond our solar bubble thanks to the consistent streams of data that Voyager 2 returned for years. Even though it was more than 20 billion kilometers from Earth, it nonetheless served as humanity's eyes and ears in the cosmic ocean. Voyager 2 isn't just any probe, though it's old. Its tools are restricted and its systems are brittle. To conserve electricity, its cameras were switched off a long time ago. It returns readings of radiation levels, magnetic fields, and particles. As it traveled out into space, scientists anticipated that the signals would stay constant or perhaps gradually shift. Instead, they discovered a bizarre, unexplained, and concealed gearbox in early 2025 that didn't fit any known natural pattern. There was more to this than a malfunction. It came from the emptiness. In the words of renowned physicist Moke, the universe just whispered to us in a way we never imagined. This quiet voyage had abruptly evolved into something far more significant, appending the scientific establishment and making everyone reevaluate what is out there in space. After the amazing voyage of Voyager 2, the next section delves into the enigmatic transmission that brought the world to a halt. Unusual, concealed, and utterly disturbing signals. What was revealed by these transmissions? And why did they startle people so much? Let's investigate the concealed gearbox. The pulses were unsettling. Scientists detected a low, eerie hum as they translated the information into sound as if something living and observing. The probe seems to have discovered a cosmic heartbeat. This wasn't just noise or interference. According to one researcher, unlike everything organically created in space, it held a pattern, purposeful structure. The fact that Voyager 2 appeared to react was much more unsettling. After decades of moving outward in a straight line, its trajectory slightly changed. It wasn't a malfunction or a random change. It appeared to be a planned withdrawal, as though the spacecraft had been alerted to the presence of a strong and unknown threat. All systems were operating flawlessly, but the thrusters weren't firing. This deliberate, nuanced move was unheard of. Mission scientists initially had a hard time figuring out what the probe was picking up. Was it a brand new kind of cosmic occurrence? Or was the boundary of our solar system awaiting something else? Something man-made? Natural causes were ruled out after weeks of investigation. The particle fluxes and magnetic field aberrations suggested an artificial barrier or warning system responding to Voyager 2. Michikaku considered the situation. There is more to this transfer than science. The word from the cosmos is, 
You are not alone. But don't come closer. Experts discovered that Voyager 2 had sent off a silent alarm in the dark, and the planet came to a halt. The question grew more pressing as the secret broadcast came to light. What did Voyager 2 run into? The unthinkable boundary the probe encountered will be examined in the next section. A huge, unnatural perimeter, unlike anything we've ever seen. What does it signify for the human race? Running into the unthinkable limit? The findings from Voyager 2 presented a disturbing image. The probe had been in the solar system for a while. It had encountered a limit that was unlike any other. Researchers discovered no gas, dust, or background radiation in this region. A pure emptiness inside a void. This was not a naturally unoccupied space. It had been cleared away by someone, leaving a weird, unusually quiet area. The border appeared to extend invisibly across space, changing particle fluxes and bending magnetic fields in ways that were contrary to modern physics. This was no vacant patch or haphazard cloud. There was a building, a containment zone or boundary of sorts, and sophisticated force with a purpose, rather not necessarily living beings, was suggested by the repetitive electromagnetic pulses. Some researchers started to hypothesize that this border might be a warning system or quarantine imposed by a much earlier and more powerful civilization than our own. It might exist for defense, deterrence, or even trapping. An instinctive reaction was triggered when Voyager 2's withdrawal indicated that it had crossed a line it wasn't intended to cross. Michioka said it this way, Everything is altered by this border. It's a cosmic border that serves a function that we cannot comprehend. A reminder of space being guarded and not merely empty. This was more than just a space science finding. Humanity was forced to consider if we are watched, or even constrained as a result of this existential shift. Voyager 2's equipment are still sending signals as it slowly drifts away. The silent pulse continues to reverberate in the background. A disturbing reminder that the probe touched something unthinkable. Even as the severity of the disruption decreases, it is unknown what is on the other side of this line. However, one thing is evident. Humanity has entered a universe that is bigger and more intricate than it could have ever dreamed. We'll then examine Miyokaku's emotional reaction in further detail as well as the implications of this event for science and the universe. The narrative is far from finished. The emotional reaction of Michikaku one of the top physicists in the world, Miyoku, did not simply respond as a scientist when the data was received. He started crying. Humanity has been wondering, are we alone in the universe? For decades, the secret signal from Voyager 2 wasn't merely a suggestion. Even the most logical brains were shaken by the unthinkable reality it presented to us. This is not just a signal, Kaku clarified. It reveals our curiosity and vulnerability. It wasn't just terror that carried the emotional burden. The realization that we might be being observed or contained had a significant effect. It called into question all of our preconceived notions about space. The immensity was no longer a silent emptiness, but rather a place where enormity and hidden intellect coexist. For a long time, scientists had been debating the Fermi paradox. The perplexing quiet in spite of space's immensity. According to Voyager 2's findings, the stillness may be due to something out there purposefully avoiding communication or concealing itself rather than us being alone. It is no coincidence that the universe is quiet. According to Kaku, it's quiet because it wants to be. It wasn't just an emotional response. It caused a great deal of thought in the defense and scientific circles around the world. How do you interpret proof that something so sophisticated and unknown is keeping tabs on us at all times? Miyaku's tears represented a time when cosmic mystery and human curiosity collided, and the entire weight of the unknown was felt. Moving on from Miyokaku's emotional response, we now discuss the signal's technical aspects. Pulses that appear to have intelligence and intent were sent to Voyager 2. What are the meanings of these signals? And why do they differ from what we've seen thus far? Let's get started. The signal's characteristics that decode the eerie pulse. Voyager 2 found a signal that wasn't just noise. This pulse, which occurred every 61.2 seconds, 
had a distinct pattern. Although each wave is a little different, they are all consistent enough to imply purpose. Scientists perceived a low, eerie hum, almost like a warning or a heartbeat, when they translated the signal into sound. Particle bursts and magnetic field distortions associated with the pulse were examined by experts. This was not your typical cosmic backdrop. It had layers, rhythm, and structure. The signal implied a communication method, an encoded object, or a marking purposefully positioned in space. This message is not like a radio broadcast. A prominent astronomer stated, It's more like a beacon or a boundary marker telling anyone who approaches, this is not your place. Such a pulse would be produced using unthinkably sophisticated technology that could manipulate magnetic fields and space-time over great distances. By using AI to sort through the data, researchers were able to find minute modulations that were concealed inside the pulses. These patterns suggested intricacy, possibly a code or language, that was incomprehensible to humans. This communication scope and structure alluded to a type of intelligence that is unconstrained by life as we know it. The discovery of pulses by Voyager 2 challenges our understanding of contact. It is not a hello or a handshake, but rather a warning, a wordless declaration of existence that has a force and enigma that we are just now starting to understand. We now move on to the amazing technology underlying this cosmic limit and what it tells us about the civilization that may have constructed it after deciphering the signal's unsettling pulse. How highly developed must they be to produce something so extensive and accurate? Behind the boundary technology of the two met, the border voyager is more than a mere fence. It seems to create a containment or protective zone by warping magnetic fields and possibly space seam itself. Nothing that humanity has created or even fully theorized can match this manipulation of fundamental forces. The existence of this structure was difficult for scientists to explain. The dust dash, gas dash, and radiation-free void indicated active maintenance. In a way we have never seen before, something was forming this empty space, keeping it steady, and changing the surroundings. According to a space physicist, this type of technology would necessitate a physics knowledge that extends beyond general relativity and quantum mechanics. It suggests having control over space's vacuum. If an ancient civilization created this, their powers would be orders of magnitude greater than anything found on Earth. The ramifications are astounding. Such technology has the potential to quarantine anything toxic, build invisible walls, or even obscure entire regions of space. It could keep an eye on things or people and enforce restrictions. This boundary may be a type of cosmic security system intended to keep people out or to keep the cosmos secure. It's a wake-up call for humanity. There is more to the universe than merely exploration. It's a place governed by technology and forces that are far beyond our own. Let's move on from technology and examine how this revelation has been received around the world. What responses have governments, military chiefs, and scientists had to the fact that Voyager 2 had crossed a line drawn by an unidentified intelligence? Worldwide reaction. Voyager 2's surprise transfer of data didn't simply generate headlines when it got to Earth. It led to secret meetings in government, military, and scientific circles around the world. It was astounding to consider that we had come upon a man-made border outside of our solar system. Leaders had to answer challenging questions. Was this border defensive, a warning, or a threat? Worst-case scenarios were taken into consideration by military establishments. Was this some cosmic defense mechanism meant to keep us out? Or worse, to contain something hazardous? Scientists discussed how to modify the current plans for space exploration. Without knowing the limitations, it may no longer be prudent or safe to send probes farther into interstellar space. According to a top NASA official, we are approaching a new period where care is necessary when exploring. There was also a lot of pressure regarding public information at the same time. What is the appropriate amount to share? Although the globe was fascinated, nations considered the possibility of worldwide panic against national security. This finding was more than a scientific conundrum. 
It was a geopolitical event that might have far-reaching effects. The riddle that never goes away. Slowly, Voyager 2 keeps moving away from the limit it came across. Even if the disruptions are decreasing, the instrument is still returning data. The eerie pulse is still there, albeit it is weak. A reminder that there is still someone out there observing from beyond this queue. Researchers are working feverishly to decipher the signal. Layered modulations in the pulse have been discovered by advanced AI tools, suggesting intricate coding that may take decades or more to decode. However, there is a genuine chance that we will never fully comprehend it. Not all messages are intended for us. Humanity is forced to reconsider its role in the universe by this mystery. At one point, we thought that the edge of our solar system was a landmark en route to the stars. It now feels more like a gate, a boundary created by forces beyond our current understanding. Michioku stated it simply. Voyager 2 demonstrated to us that the universe has observed us and is alive with power and intellect that surpasses our comprehension. The subtle warning from Voyager 2 permanently alters our perception of the universe. One thing is certain, yet it is unclear what lies beyond this line. The universe has taken notice of us and we are no longer alone. Stay alert, stay curious, and follow along as this story develops.